I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys. Ready. All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Lee going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Great punch lands with so much power. Well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Misses with that punch. on the high kick there. Not there. He blocks the punch. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Lee. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Plans the right hand. Oh, nice. That's a big strike right there. We cross the midpoint in round one. Oh, well done moving the head there to slip that left hand. Looking to land the leg kick now. Oh, beautiful counter with the punch there and certainly making good use of what is an obvious edge in reach. Hands up! And he lands a punch there, pretty good connection by him. Great connection, he's in a great flow right now. Clean left punch followed by the right. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. It's okay. Use your footwork. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Big head kick. Oh! The jab followed by the right hand. Right punch is there. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most, if not all, of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Throws the right hand there. Big leg kick land. Let's go, grind on it. Push, push, push. Straight right hand, no good. Nice punch there. He is all about that left kick to the body. 
Oh, big right hand, yes. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Oh, man, these are hard. And the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Just missing on that uppercut offering. Oh man, hit the land. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. Big powerful punch lands, now he gets back to range. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Just unable to quite find that range. Lands flush with that right hand. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. to the body now, that one won't land. Great punch. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab, he may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Yeah, good shot, good shot. Try to establish that jab. Such a fast leg kick. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Big punch land. Ooh. Oh, and there he goes, working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab is nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch, and the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Hey. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Nice try. to the body, that one blocked. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round, no denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Trying to go to the body now with the kick, that one misses. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Checks that leg kick. Oh, pinpoint jab to the head on the counter for him. And again, he's the longer fighter. It's going to be easier for him to counter than his opponent. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow.
Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Come on, push through it. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Trying to establish that jab once again. Fifteen seconds. And final seconds here. Oh, and he just keeps on coming with these shots to the liver. Looking to buckle him once again. Buckled him earlier in the fight. And the fighter is still open to damage there as he continues to target that sensitive area. All right, well, that was a crazy round. I don't know if we should lob the chin of his opponent or give him the credit for landing head kick after head kick. When the head kicks land this often on the video game, it's because player one understands the game much better than player two. Tell your friend how to play the game, teach him how to block, or teach him how to throw the head kick, too. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, blocked the shot there, and then delivers the straight counter. Just out of range with that left hook. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Just misses with the straight left hand. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's going to put him to sleep. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that one. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Powerful leg kick lands. Circling away towards the left now. Big kick lands. Oh, he's wearing it now, bleeding from his cheek. Oh, nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this match. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Out of range with that one. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds. And it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges out of it. Good punch. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Real sneaky body kick. Right there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Pretty good execution for him there on the sidekick, DC. Just really feeling the one of those traditional martial arts techniques that are making their way to the UFC's octagon. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Straight punch lands. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Set up the overhand now. 
He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Well, that'll quiet the storm. Shot blocked by Leach. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. And he landed the right hand there. Beautiful strike. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Big kick lands. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. And they separate. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Nice punch lands over the top. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. All right, here we go with our next round. And really shades of the Diaz brothers in that previous round. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy, just a lot of efficiency on the field. Very, very efficient. Good round in the sense that he did not throw everything with absolute power, but he was touching the entire time. And every now and again, he was set down with a strike that was really damaging his opponent. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Good punch land. Kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Amazing that we could get to this point of the fight and he would not show even a modicum of a sign of fatigue. Well, he's doing a very good job of managing his cardio. He doesn't throw everything with 100% power. He throws things to set up. He does a good job of knowing when to go and knowing when to slow down and showing. Look at his cardio. That's not even breathing. Both fighters throwing heat now. Good defense to block the strike coming back. It's okay, keep going. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. He just hurt him with a left hook. Yep. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, big punch land. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Kick to the body by Lee. Had him whip his hip into that kick. Just misses there with the left. Nice. What a body kick. Nice. 
Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Lee. Big leg kick land. Look at the turtle in that kick. Seconds now remain in the round. Lee's kick to the body, that one blocked by the defense. Dig and kick. Final minute now of round four. Punch coming, it's blocked. Let me see that hook now. Trying to do damage now with the kick, that's a miss. Can't take many of those, you better check. 30 seconds to go in this one. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. That shot blocked by Lee. Hey. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Head kick. That was the issue. Nice strike. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. Sit up that high kick. Slips the punch nicely there. Looked like he might have landed there instead. A swing and a miss by Lee. Come on now. Let's move. Let's make it move. Stay focused. Just misses with a left hook there. Set up your shots. Nice punch there by Lee. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked, you have the Anderson Silva situation. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Real quick leg kick. sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talk to the tough man. Just a slip there. Ooh, what a head kick. Ooh, what a punch. Just missed with the left there. Two punches true. And both guys really throwing with authority. And that left hook landed on the button. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Use your hands to set up that low kick now. Good stick. 
Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Two minutes now to go in this one. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Let's go. One, two, high. Back to the jab now, no good. Oh, nice job to block the kick. How good is that right hand? Hands up. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh! Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Lee. Nice body. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Kick lands. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Nice, good. Keep that pressure. They're about to play. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Nice punch lands over the top. Nice. Able to check the high kick. Oh, that right hand is on point. Gonna land the right just out of range. 20 seconds left. Big kick land. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Effective punch there by Lee. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, it looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has on so many occasions tonight. What else can you say but what a fight? All right, so a lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight. Largely got it done with the strike. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. He's known as a guy that's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand-up. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent.